Hi Chris, ahead of the tenant moving in tomorrow. Um, I've just done my final checks, uh, making sure everything's fit and ready for the new tenant. So here is our sign off video. So as you can see on the side of the property here, we've uh, just finished off the painting at the top there. Um, when the guy stood on his shoulders to do the painting, he only got to around here. And now we've finished off this top area. So that just finished off nicely. But also the pointing on the verge, that was all cracked and potentially letting rainwater in. So we filled the verge in with mortar and now your roof is nice and tight. With, this was like a forest at the front, if you remember. So we've de-weeded, we've strimmed the lawn and also we've got rid, finally got rid of the skip. Um, so I think we took about two or three skips out the back garden of this property. Um, and I'll show you that in a second. Um, and one other thing we've done out here, just to weatherproof it, um, we've resealed all the windows with new silicon because uh, they had lots of gaps in. Um, also replaced a window pane at the front there as well. Um, and in here, this was like a half finished porch area. So the flooring, we've just had the concrete floor exposed. So put some nice matting down, some nice cost effective way. And it's also somewhere nice, you know, to put the shoes, stop them taking moisture into the house as well. And as you know, we've got a damp proof course all the way around the property, all the solid walls. Um, so it was suffering from damp. Um, we've had the damp report done on it and we've got it injected with damp proof injection cream, um, which stops any more moisture rising into the property. Now we had two choices, as you know, we could hack off all the plaster um, that was affected, but the, it wasn't too bad. So instead of hacking it off, putting a Delta membrane on and replastering, we decided um, that yes, some residual might come through, but that is gonna clear up over the next few weeks. Um, and it's gonna save us a lot of money doing it that way. So other things that we've done this property is, you know, um, we've put a radiator in this porch um, because yeah, we're suffering from damp. This is a really cold room and so you need to get some heat in there. So brand new radiator. And look at this property, doesn't it look lovely? Nice new floor, I'll show you a bit better in here. Lovely property. As I say, all the damp has now been remedied. Um, this was also falling off. Now we've got it nice and securely fixed. We don't want anything falling on our tenants. Let me show you the garden. It's perfect for a family, this property. The size of that. We have a lovely five-a-side football. We have seven-a-side football here. Um, now, have we got moles? Um, maybe, or maybe someone just spilled some soil. Let me ask the builders about that. But as you know, um, it seemed like over the years, um, things have been dumped at the bottom of this garden. Who knows who's done it? But you can see it's all cleared now. As you say, it was two or three skips, all, um, all gone now. So yeah, so this rents for 725. It's in the Crocs of, in Liverpool. And in the kitchen, absolutely lovely. Look at that kitchen, brand new kitchen, lovely and fresh. Um, we've also sorted out these window handles, so these old school window handles. Um, as you can see it there, they kind of um, they latch onto the sides of the frame, um, and the bit that it latches on has fallen off. But the newer versions uh, come with less parts, basically. So they just stick out and grip on properly. Let me show you upstairs. So in the bathroom, the bathroom had no shower. Can you believe it? So look at the bathroom, it's absolutely lovely. Um, so we installed a shower there. Um, we've got a nice new shower screen in, tidied it all up. We've also put in a nice DMEV fan. So these fans are fantastic. Um, they really help with any damp. If you've got any damp, problems, I definitely recommend getting these DMEV fans. What they do is they continuously run on like a low level without boring you too much. And when they sense humidity or when you turn the lights on, they kick in and boost on high mode. Um, and they're fantastic at getting rid of damp. So this is another one of the bedrooms. Pretty big. Just two bed and all. But you can see it's absolutely a lovely design with the stairs coming up into the centre there, off to the bathroom and the bedrooms either side. 
is probably what you call the master bedroom. See, it's really big. And with the boiler there in the cupboard, which is fantastic. Obviously, we'll put some flooring on the bottom there as well, uh, just to finish it off nicely. Um, gas safe's all been signed off with the smoke and the um, CO detectors. And we've started doing that. We're getting our gas safe engineers to, on their gas safe certs, to tick off, yes, we've got smoke detectors. Watch this not work now. Wait. <laughs> yes, we've got smoke detectors. Um, yes, we've got CO detectors. And with that being signed off by a gas safe engineer, it just carries a little bit more weight and really protects your investment in case there's any claims in the future. So um, I hope you found that um, walk around useful. And if you've got any questions, please let me know.